Hey everybody, it's Lauren from Dressing Dallas. Today we are just going to do a fun little tutorial for the spring and summertime. We're going to do this really easy floral crown. So I hope you guys enjoy and make sure you subscribe. You only need a couple things for this project. You need some floral tape, some floral wire, a couple strands of thicker floral wire to make the headband, and of course, some beautiful flowers of your choice. So with this longer floral wire, it's not quite thick enough to hold the weight of these flowers. So I'm just going to twist two together and then I am just going to twist them into a band for my head. And don't forget to measure your head. You don't want your floral ground to be too big or too small. So now taking some floral tape, we are going to wrap our headband all the way around. This is going to help conceal that white color because I couldn't quite find any thicker green wire. And this is also going to help adhere the flowers later once we start putting them on. Floral tape is pretty cool because when it gets a little bit wet with the moisture of the flowers, it really sticks together nicely. So it's very useful when we're doing this crown. So now we're just going to pick up our fillers and we're going to measure them into a small little bundle and this is all up to personal preference. I'm doing this in small bundles and attaching it to the floral crown but you can attach individual stalks to the floral crown just as easily so it's really personal preference. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure and make just a tiny little bouquet of these wildflowers and I'm going to arrange them the way that I want and then we're going to just wrap it with floral tape to keep it in place. So now what we're going to do that we've made this cute little bouquet is we're going to attach it to the headband that we made. So I've already attached one so we can get an idea of what it looks like. So what we're going to do is we're going to place it where we want looking at the first bundle of flowers and then we're going to take our floral wire and we're going to wrap it all the way around our second little bouquet. And the reason why we're doing floral wire is to make it more sturdy. Now that we have a little bit of floral wire on there holding it in place, we're going to conceal it and make it even stronger with a little bit of floral tape. What I like to do is I like to alternate my little bundles of flowers and fillers to just a little bundle of fillers and this really adds a nice wildflower element to it and I think it looks really pretty. So now we're going to add our really pretty peonies, one of my favorite flowers. All we're going to do is we're going to take the individual peony and we're going to place it where we think would look best on the band and then we are going to wrap it with floral wire and then floral tape. And this is all just kind of eyeballing it. So just do your best and when you're done and it's secure, just snip off the stem. So 
So now we're just going to do a little bit of fast forwarding and you're going to watch me very, very quickly put together this beautiful flower crown. And basically I'm just doing the same exact process, making little bundles, wrapping them with floral tape and then attaching them to the band. There you have it you guys, you have a nice beautiful flower crown to wear to whatever event you want. And see, it wasn't too bad to put together. And if you guys make a flower crown, I want to see it, so make sure you tag me at Dressing Dallas. Thanks for watching, bye!